need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. Word contains many of the standard multi-level list formats that you will need to create commonly used outlines and agendas. However, you can also modify the multi-level list styles within Word to create custom styles that you can use within your documents. To modify a multi-level list style within Word, start by selecting a multi-level list style to modify by choosing one from the multi-level list drop-down menu. After selecting a style, you can then click the drop-down arrow in the multi-level list button within the paragraph button group on the home tab within the ribbon. From the drop-down menu that appears, click the Define New Multi-Level List command to open the Define New Multi-Level List dialog box. Within this dialog box, you can click on a level within the list to modify from the hierarchy of levels shown at the left side of the dialog box. Then, in the Number Format section below, you can enter the formatting for the number into the Enter Formatting for Number field. If needed, you can click the adjacent font button to specify a specific font face for the level within the font dialog box, and then click the OK button to apply it. You can choose a numbering style for the selected list level from the number style for this level drop-down. Then, in the position section, you can select an alignment from the number alignment drop-down. You can then set the alignment of the number for the selected level in the Aligned At field. You can then set the alignment of the adjacent text for that level into the Text Indent At field. You can then repeat this process for the various levels that you wish to modify within your new multi-level list style. Note that if you need even more options than the ones that are shown, such as the ability to set the starting numbering or when the list level should reset to a new list, you can click the More button at the bottom of this dialog box to expand the sections shown. You can then set any of the additional advanced options that appear in the expanded section if required for your new list. Once you have made your modifications to the selected list style, simply click the OK button to apply the new multi-level list style. You will then be able to select it as needed within your documents by using the multi-level list button. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www dot teachucomp dot com forward slash enterprise dash licensing.